Welcome to another virtual Tweet of the Week. And I am really excited to be joined by Lisa Brook, who is our teacher specialist for elementary science at the Earth Space Science Lab. You may know her more, though, as the lady who hangs out with Drupal. And Lisa, I am so excited about the things that you and Adam are doing since our students can't visit the Earth Space Science Lab right now, you are trying to take it to them, so to speak. So tell us about your tweets and your Facebook Live events and all the cool things that are going on at the Earth Space Science Lab. Well, thank you very much uh, for having us in this virtual uh, venue. We, we were really, um, you know, it, it's really hard when you're used to seeing kids every single day um, to not see them anymore. So we wanted to have some sort of um, functionality where we could still interact with the students and showcase the ESSL. So we thought about it and Adam and I, we thought, hey, let's do Facebook Live events because in that platform, we would have the opportunity to talk um, with uh, the audience and have some interaction with them. Uh, so of course, we had to start with Drupal. So uh, he was very uh, well received. He had uh, close to 6,000 views uh, with, with just Drupal. So every Tuesday and Thursday, uh, Adam and I do a Facebook Live that is from some place in the ESSL uh, to either showcase a certain um, piece of the ESSL or maybe a topic of interest. And so what happens if I missed this? I didn't know it was going on. Is there a way for students and their families to catch previous episodes? Absolutely. So after the Facebook Live goes live, we can then archive that video stream, put it on YouTube, and all of our episodes can be seen from our website. So just going to the ESSL's website, uh, you'll see a place to click and be able to view all the episodes. Now, do you have a particular favorite of the ones that you've done so far? Well, uh, I just came inside from doing a Facebook Live with Adam. Adam did a tour of the Arboretum. And I think this one might take the cake because there was a Bigfoot sighting. Oh, my. For real. So uh, there was a lot of discussion on the uh, Facebook Live on the comment section, um, the students kept pointing out that they saw Bigfoot, but Adam and I, I don't know what they're talking about. So we're gonna have to look through that video uh, and see what happened. Well, I think I'm gonna have to go jump on that archive and check it out as well. So Lisa, I wanna thank you, not only for being my guest on Tweet of the Week this week, but also to thank you and Adam for finding a creative way to try to bring experiences to our students because we know that distance learning is not the same, um, but you are certainly trying to make sure that any experience they missed in the ESSL this year, they're getting to remotely enjoy it a little bit and I hope it whets their appetite for what they will get to do next year when we're all back in school and and they can come back and see Drupal and you and Adam live. So thank you so much for all you're doing and thanks for joining me today. Thank you so much. And we hope to see all of you next time for our virtual Tweet of the Week. <laughs>